just four days away from the biggest television event of the year, Super Bowl Sunday. The game is at Mercedes-Benz Stadium in Atlanta, where the field is painted and they are now testing out all those lights. Yeah, the music's getting me hyped. The Patriots <laughs> and Rams will battle for the Lombardi Trophy, but the players also want that Super Bowl ring. Yes, they do, and those rings are made right here in Texas. Daniel Gotera takes us behind the scenes. It's the prize that all these players are playing for a championship ring and it turns out in Houston there's a place that makes them. I went to go find out what exactly that process is all about. So we're here at Uptown Diamond in Houston, one of the premier ring manufacturers for championship rings here with Rick Antona. What makes a great championship ring? Well, obviously, first we have to have a great team and then with a great team, we have to come up with some incredible designs. The ring has to really tell an incredible story. What are the elements that make it so good? It's the quality of the diamonds. Yeah. I mean, that's the, the next best thing, is making sure you use high quality diamonds. When Bering and Uptown Diamond uh, came together, we decided we're gonna take it to another level. Talking about that customization process, let's take a look. Okay, here with the guy behind the magic, the creator of the rings, Alberto. That's a big title for you, a big responsibility. How cool is this whole process for you to be a part of? It's really cool. This is how we create the rings from this software. Every single ring is different. So we transfer um, every single file to the 3D printer. And poof, TV magic, we're right here at the 3D printer. 3D printers made it where anybody can actually make a championship ring now, yeah. so which is pretty cool. Before we used to use metal molds, and then for metal molds, when 3D printing came out, now we can do about 100 rings in one shot. And once we get the wax, the actual blue part, then we'll take it and we'll sprue it. And we're taking it in the oven, yeah. and we put it in the oven until the, the wax will actually melt. Pour the, the gold, if it's gold, platinum, or silver, into the rings, and then from there, he'll do a kind of a, a, a semi-polish of the ring to kind of, kind of clean it up a little bit. And then the guys start setting the stones. Some owners are very generous, so they give right. everybody in the organization a ring. As we saw with the Astros. <laughs> Mr. Crane was unbelievably generous. So now you know how it's done. Rick, thanks so much. Thank Appreciate you. Appreciate it. Uptown Diamond, remember that name.